How long does it take for a brain to heal from pornography consumption? I'm Dr. Trish Lee. Let me answer that question for you. Okay, this is an updated video because many people are upset with the non-answer in the original video that I made. Unfortunately, I am going to have to give you a non-answer in this updated video, but I'm going to give you a lot more details so that perhaps you can figure out in your particular situation how long it might take for your brain to heal. Okay, so how long does it take? It takes time of unwiring the brain pattern that you have been consistently wiring into your brain for days, weeks, months, years, or decades. And it takes time to rewire in the new, better brain pattern for calm focus. So how long that is, is difficult to answer. But the variables that are included are the duration of your habit, the frequency, how often, the consistency, are you on a cycle or a schedule, the intensity, has the type of pornography that you're consuming increased in intensity because that means that it's giving your brain an even larger dose of the neurochemical dump into your brain that is hooking your brain to the screen when it comes to pornography. The key to success is unwiring that brain pattern that needs to go back for more and more pornography to calm and stimulate your brain simultaneously. So traditionally, uh, people say that it takes 90 days. So 90 days becomes a milestone for you in the first place. And if you work with any traditionally trained professionals in this area, which I'm also trained traditionally, but I include the neuroscience aspect, you will find that 90 days is a goalpost for most people. And that's because it takes at least 90 days to really unwire that brain pattern. You also, on top of time, need the rewiring of the new, better brain pattern because unwiring is only half of the formula. Rewiring your brain so that it becomes on purpose in your real life becomes a really important aspect of recovery and rebooting your brain and your nervous system. So if you daily engage in new habits, routines, and new thought processes, so you are rewiring in the new, better brain pattern for calm focus, the time frame is going to be shorter. So Another aspect that you can include is brain training. My neuroscience background and my profession for the last decade has been helping people to achieve the goals in their life that they want to achieve by training their brain out of the pattern that has got them into the habits or the struggles or the challenges that they find themselves in currently. We have to unwire that pattern and then using neuroscience and technology to hardwire in a new, better brain pattern while you're also rebooting your behaviors. So I'm gonna give you some arbitrary timeframes because people really want them, but if you start today, it may get a little bit more challenging before it gets easier. If it does get more challenging, your brain is already starting to heal. So literally, it can take one day to start the healing and the healing path of your brain from pornography consumption. Doesn't mean it's gonna feel good in that first day, but it means the healing is working. Then as you keep going, a week later, your brain will feel better. You'll usually start to feel better within a week or two. But classically speaking, there can be hurdles at the 30 month time frame, the, the 30 day time frame, the 60 day time frame, and at the 90 day time frame, people are really feeling confident and they're moving in the right direction. If you use brain training tools like the headband that I recommend, you have something to keep rewiring in the new better brain pattern after that 90 day mark. And by then people can really feel the momentum of their brain healing and moving in the right direction. Okay, so I hope that is a better non-answer. You're shooting for 90 days of no fap so that you can 
unwire the brain pattern that is coupled itself to the screen through a neurochemical uh, connection. And then you want to reboot your routines, your habits, your lifestyle. And what you're going for is coupling your brain to another human being for relational sex and getting that optimal neurochemical release in the real world. And you will feel that you'll feel it on day one the healing will begin it may not feel good but you will be moving in the right direction if you stay the course you will achieve the goals that you want if you're interested in helping that journey uh, check out my programs at drtrishley.com because i'm here for you i got your back it can be difficult for many people and remember control your brain or it'll control you